All right, everybody, today's the day. We're going to be tuning this 2020 F-250 here. As most of you know, uh, tuning these 2020 plus F-250s has kind of been a hassle here in the past two or three years. You had to send your ECU off to be unlocked previously. And then uh, AMDP came out with a flashing device that, that uh, allowed you to flash the truck, you know, at home with your laptop. Uh, with the cables provided but all that and the trans tuning alone was like twenty five hundred dollars so set has come out with the uh, x4 for these trucks and you might say hey that's a really old uh device there but if we look at the part number here we've got some new stuff so this is the 7015 pd i'm assuming for power stroke diesel this thing has some funky connectors in it and stuff that we're going to plug into the uh PCM and then into the OBD2 port so uh, let's go check it out you ever just walk up to your truck and like damn that's a good looking truck all right guys we got the draggy connected we're gonna be doing a uh, 30 to 80 test here on this uh, stock truck 2020 f-250 just in drive punching it probably could do a little better if you're you know manually shifting but uh that's the data for the stock truck all right in here with the device we're gonna go ahead and open the box here we've got some uh installation instructions 2020 to 2021 f-250 power stroke or also f-350 instructions there the qr code pretty cool We've got the device, same looking uh, eight to 10 year old device as always, but with a new part number here. The dead rat, as some people call it. And I believe this in here is where the new stuff is, the trickery. So we'll pull this out. How it looks to be a OBD2 to some type of cable here. We'll set this aside. Some battery connections, some type of harness, another cord, and then our OBD2 cord. So, last but not least, we have what appears to be the uh, PCM connector to this device here with the OBD2 on the other end. So let's see, uh, let's see how this works, guys. Stay tuned. As you can see, we're on the SET website here. 2020 to 2021 F-Series diesel cable slash X4 bundle, $599, custom tuning, preloaded tunes. So as you can see, this is a lot cheaper than the uh, AMDP $2,500 method. Let's see uh, what this does here. This is emissions on tuning, guys. Um, this is completely legal. No deletes, no smoke, no problems. This is not actually on the website, uh, but I got on the 2020 plus power stroke group message SCT and they said that the performance tune added 76 horse and 210 torque and then you can see the others here so we'll see what she does so I've got the instructions pulled up here they've got a nice little PDF file that you can scan with your phone or open on your computer like I do so it looks like the first thing we are gonna have to do is get access to the ECU here disconnect the connectors so we're gonna go ahead and do all that follow the instructions and get it all on video for you guys all right, guys, it says first step is to locate the ECU in the firewall, which we did. Release the locking tabs and disconnect all three ECU connectors. We're going to go ahead and do that. Here we are under the hood. This looks to be the area in question here. We're going to keep following the instructions. All right, so we're disconnecting these uh, three ECU connectors that it says to disconnect first. So I got two of them pretty much undone here. little locks aren't too bad. Gotta press a little lock, release the locking tab like that. And I guess move the harness out of the way here. Let's see. Stuck on that one. 
Okay, those two. And lastly, there we go. So that's all three of them unplugged. Let's see what the next step is. All right, so the next step here, step five, is to uh, connect the ECU connector provided with the X4 to the connection one on the ECU, ECU as shown and to the SCT box. So we just gotta find which connector that is. This will be plugging in for this right here. And uh, we'll go from there. All right, it looks like uh, connection one is the outboard most uh, connector here. Closest to the passenger side fender, which would be outboard. So that's, uh, that looks like it right there. So let's go ahead and try to plug this guy in here. Yeah. All right, so the next step is gonna be plugging in the uh, X4 OBD2 cable to the SUT box. So we're gonna do that now. So that's done. And then the next step is to plug this into the battery. So we're gonna go black to black. Red to red. And then it says to plug this into the SCT box. So we've done that. And the X4 just powered up. We're gonna go to program vehicle, just like it says. Street use notice. This is some bull crap about don't use this in California. We're not in California. Here's something clicking over there. Stuff's clicking. Processing some data here. All right, so we've got uh, engine preloaded tunes. It says six seven Super Duty. So we're gonna click on that. All right, so we have some uh, engine tune. What are you doing? We have some engine tune uh, stuff here. We got tow, street, and performance. We'll just try the hot tune for now and see what it does. We're gonna click approve. Engine tune performance. So it should start saving the stock file here. We will cut to what happens next. One of our cookies this week, babe, is called <laughs> Alright, so here we are riding tune to the vehicle. We've saved the stock file. We're currently flashing the ECU. Alright, there you have it. Download complete. Tune has been programmed successfully to the vehicle. Alright, the next step is actually once we loaded the tune onto the ECU, it says to reconnect the ECU by disconnecting the battery clamps and reconnecting all the three ECU connectors. Guys, as you can see, I've disconnected everything and I've replugged in all the factory ECU connections. Now we're going to tune the trans. All right, guys, so tuning your TCU, it says to unplug the X4 from the engine bay in here, and you will be going under your dash to your OBD2 port to tune the TCU. Here we go. All right, we're in the truck. We've got the device here plugged into the OBD2 port, like the old days. We're going to go to program vehicle, continue, just going to process some data here. We'll select this. Engine tune is on performance. Transmission. Preloaded tunes. Here we go. Okay, just gonna load this transmission tune here. Press continue. And here she goes. She's now gonna flash the TCU. All right, guys, the TCU is now downloading the tune. All from inside the truck here, like the old days. <laughs>